John Swindles here, Fight Up TV, with uh, the Man Mountain, Olympic gold medalist, member of the British Empire, Andy Joshua. Does it get much better than that? Yeah, uh, I've got Ali's, Tyson's, and then there's me. <laughs> yeah. six, six KOs from six fights. Yeah. How's that feel already? It's going well, you know, but it's uh, early days, so I think that's how it should be going so far. Um, but it's about longevity, and uh, we started off good, and I mean to end that way as well in the future. Brilliant. Um, and you've got Matt Skelton coming up here. Toughest test of your career so far, do you think? Uh, as a professional, that's correct. Um, but, you know, there's nothing tougher than training, so I feel that like the fights are won behind closed doors. Um, so yeah, it's tough, but I pushed myself in the gym, so I should be alright. And uh, now has the camp gone from this? Have you, have you changed anything at all, or has it been a, a regular routine? Training, I train all year round, but I think like as time goes on, you naturally develop. Um, some people want to make change, but change don't happen instantly. So over the last like six years, I think things are slowly coming together now, organically. So yeah, man, I think there'll be a more relaxed, balanced, and sharp shooter come Saturday. Brilliant. And what um, challenges are you facing in this fight with Matt Skelton? Just myself, really. I'm my own biggest, uh, I'm my own biggest enemy. You know, I'm, I'm my own biggest success. So it's just doing my own thing, getting the rhythm right, getting my focus right, getting my mind together, and then I should be putting on a good performance. So it's, I don't really watch my opponents. Uh, weaknesses, strengths, and whatnot. I do study them, but I worry about myself going into the fight. Anything else that you might want to add to, to your fans? To, to um, listen, appreciate the support at the end of the day. Um, Box is a tough game. Um, anyone that steps in the ring, you know, I, I've been compared to Audley Harrison leading up to this fight by Matt Skelton, and I take my hat off to Audley at the end of the day. Not many people have gone out there and won gold medals for their country and achieve great things in their own right. Some have, some haven't. But, you know, sometimes it's good to be positive. It's not always about being negative. And boxing's a tough sport, man. Do you know what I mean? Um, so, uh, like, Saturday, you'll be under the bright lights and then it's back to that, that, that greasy, grimy gym putting in hard work, you know, blood, sweat and tears. And sometimes, you know, you've got to be positive because uh, you get criticised in the gym 24-7. So sometimes when you do your work, win, lose or draw, it's good to have a positive outcome, man. And that's why my main message in that is get behind your fellow fighters and support them regardless. As long as someone gives it their best, you can't ask for any more. Sorry. Uh, you've got, you're fighting on an undercard with Bellew and Cleverly, leading up to a fight with them eventually. Who do you think wins a rematch in that fight? Don't know, they're cruiserweight now. We'll have to wait and see. No, no, no favourite in that fight? No favourites, they're both talented fighters, man. That's fantastic. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Fight Up TV. Cheers.